Apple has just announced that it will start taking pre-orders for Apple Watch Series 7 from this Friday October 8th at 5 a.m. Pacific, 8 a.m. Eastern and 1 p.m. London, then, on sale availability will be the following Friday October 15th. This fits with rumors and reports of when it might be and even, I'm modestly proud to say, chimes with the timings I predicted. The announcement came after many had reported that Apple was having trouble manufacturing the new watch, not least because the design is different from Series 6. Well, it looks like those issues are now in the past as Apple is confirming pre-orders so soon, just two weeks after the iPhone 13 series went on sale. Apple had also surprised many because the watch it announced didn't look like many leaks had suggested it would. The design, though certainly different, is a gentle evolution of Series 6, principally different because it has a bigger display with softer corners and thinner bezels. But the leaks had suggested something quite different. Some of those who predicted the design that didn't happen are now saying that they had leaked next year's Apple Watch. That may be true but it leaves the question of whether Apple would pursue that design now, especially because rival companies could do something very similar without infringing copyright, presumably, as Apple has never confirmed the other design. Well, that's a question for next year. For now, the next watch promises to be the most durable Apple Watch yet, with faster charging courtesy of an upgraded charging puck and cable and an even greater emphasis on fitness with new exercise sessions now live in Fitness Plus. The new Apple Watch costs $399 and up, from £379 in the UK, and comes in 5 colors in the aluminum finish, plus stainless steel and titanium options, 